In this video, we'll find the element on the periodic table that has the electron configuration 1s2, 2s2, 2p2. There are two ways we can do this. First, we could just count the electrons up. 2 plus 2 plus 2, that equals 6. So we have 6 electrons. All these elements on the periodic table, they're neutral. That means their electrons and protons are the same. So we can find the element with 6 protons. It'll have 6 electrons, and this will be our electron configuration. We can see carbon, its atomic number is 6. That means it has 6 protons, since it's neutral, 6 electrons. And the electron configuration for carbon is going to be 1s2, 2s2, 2p2. We can also do this another way. We can look at the periodic table broken up into orbital blocks. The s block, that holds up to 2 electrons. All of these are going to end in s1, s2. Then we go to the d block, that holds up to 10, so we have d1 all the way to D10 here. And then for P, we have the P block. P holds up to six electrons, P1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. This configuration here ends in 2P2. So we just need to find the element here that would be 2P2. So we go down to the second row or period. Here's 2P1 and 2P2. So this element right here will end in 2P2. This will be its electron configuration. Let's go back to the periodic table with all of the elements written in. And just like before, we have this 1s2, 2s2, 2p2. The electron configuration is going to be carbon. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.